Hey everyone, how's it going? For today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a Huggy Wuggy surprise fold. So I hope you follow along and enjoy this video today. Now to start off with our Huggy Wuggy surprise fold, we need to start by folding our paper. So the first thing we want to do is go ahead and line up our corners and make a nice fold. This will give us kind of like a birthday card shape. Now once we're done with this, we need to take our paper and fold it in half again. And this time we get kind of like a bookmark shape. Then when you open it up, you have two little lines in here and these are nice little lines to use as a guide so we know where to keep the inside and the outside of our drawing. Now to start off with our Huggy Wuggy surprise fold, we're gonna begin with the eyes. So I wanna start right here and we're gonna make a circle shape for the eye. We wanna leave some space above the fold. So I'm gonna begin right here by making a circle for one eye. We're gonna leave some space. And then I'm going to make another circle for another eye. Now, we're going to make another circle right inside of here. And then we'll do the same thing over here. We're going to make another circle right inside. We'll draw one more small circle inside each one. And I'm going to color in this medium circle. Now we want to make the mouth. So I'm gonna start right up here and we're gonna make a little line that's just gonna curve down underneath the eye. Then we'll do the same thing up over here. We'll just kind of start underneath the eye and we're gonna curve up and down. Next we're gonna make a line that's gonna go up and then it's gonna come down. Starting here, we're gonna bring this line down, and then we're gonna bring this line down. Next, we're going to draw this line down here, then we're gonna come back up and connect it to here. Now starting here, we're gonna draw a little line, it's just gonna go down, it's gonna go right across the top of the fold, and then back up for a simple little smile. Now, starting right here, we're going to draw a little circle shape for part of the bow tie. Then we're gonna draw a little line, it's gonna go down and then it's gonna come up. We'll do the same thing on this side. We go down, and then we just curve it back up. Starting here, we're gonna curve this line up, and then we'll do one inside of here. Then we'll do one here, and one here, just to make it really look like a bow tie. Right here, we'll draw a line that's gonna go down, and then we'll do one on the same side, or the other side. Little diagonal line up. And then we'll just connect them up here. Starting here, we're going to make some little pointed lines that come down just to make it look like he's got that furry body. Now starting here, I'm going to draw some little pointed lines that are just going to come up towards the top. And we'll do the same thing here. We're just going to make some little pointed lines that are just going to come up towards the top. Then we're going to bring these in and we'll add a couple more little points. 
We'll do the same thing here. We're going to just add a couple more little points as we bring this in. And then we'll connect them. Then we're just going to bring these down and we'll bring these down to here too. Then we're just going to draw a little kind of pointed line up here in the middle. So here's our first part. We have our Huggy Wuggy right here. Now we need to open it up and design the inside. Now once we open it up, we have two halves right here. We have the top and then we have the bottom. So the first thing we want to do is I'm going to start right here and we're just going to draw a line that's just going to come down. We're going to bring it right to about here and we're just going to kind of curve around. And then we're just going to bring it up to here. Next, we're going to bring this line down and then we're just going to connect it to here. And then same thing here, we're just going to bring this line down and then we just connect it right to here. Then we're going to make some more of these little pointed lines that come down. And then we're just going to connect them. And we'll do the same thing here. We're just going to bring some of these down and connect them right to there. Now inside of here, we want to put all of his crazy teeth. So these are going to be kind of like jagged and spaced out. So we're just going to kind of put these all around in different spaces. We're going to do the same thing on the bottom here. And we're also going to make some come up a little bit farther too. Now inside of here, he's going to have kind of like a second set of teeth as well. So what I'm going to do is we're going to make another little line that's just going to curve right to here. And then we're going to make one that's just going to come down and then up here. Then inside of here, we're just going to make some more kind of jagged sharp teeth. And we're going to do the same thing right across the bottom too. And there you go, here is your drawing of your Huggy Wuggy Surprise Fold. So when we have it all closed up, we just have the simple little smile. And then once we open it up, we have the big scary mouth with all the different teeth. And there you go. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed.